The month of September is bringing a wave of K-drama excitement. New stories are about to unfold, each promising a unique journey. Are you ready to discover your next obsession? Let's get started. First up is Queen Wu, a historical action drama that promises to captivate audiences with its intense power struggles and riveting political intrigue. Part 1 premieres on August 29th, with Part 2 following on September 12th. Directed by Jung Sekyo and written by Lee byung hak this drama tells the story of Queen Wu, portrayed by the talented John Jong Seo. She's the first woman to rule Goguryeo twice, and she must navigate a treacherous political landscape after the sudden death of King Deduction, played by Ji Chong Wook. With five tribes and ambitious princes vying for power, Queen Wu has just 24 hours to appoint a new king and protect her family and tribe. Next up is Fragile, a teen drama that will take you on an emotional journey through the ups and downs of teenage life. Premiering on September 9th and brought to life by writer Park Jui and director On Ji Hoon, this series offers a hyper-realistic portrayal of the struggles of high school students. It's not just about the usual drama of growing up, it's about the failures, heartbreaks, academic pressures, and the fight to break free from societal expectations. Fragile is set to resonate deeply with anyone who's ever felt the weight of the world on their shoulders during their formative years. Following that, we have The Judge from Hell is an upcoming South Korean drama premiering on September 21st. The story follows Kong Bitna, portrayed by Park Shin Hai, a devil from hell who takes on the body of a judge. Her mission is to punish those who have caused others' deaths without remorse. Alongside her is Han Don, played by Kim Jae Young, a detective known for his kind heart and keen observation skills. Together, they confront a world more hellish than hell itself as they strive to bring true justice. And then, there's Dear Hyrie that promises to tug at your heartstrings with its exploration of trauma, love, and identity. Premiering on September 23rd, it stars Shin Hai-sun as Ju Eun-ho, a news reporter who develops dissociative identity disorder following a series of traumatic events, including the disappearance of her younger sibling and a painful breakup. Her alter ego, Ju Hairi, is a lively and optimistic personality, offering a stark contrast to her true self. As the story unfolds, viewers will be drawn into the complex emotional journey of Ju Eun-ho as she struggles to reconcile her past with her present. This blend of romance and healing is sure to leave a lasting impact. Moving on, we have What Comes After Love, a melodrama adapted from the novel by Gong ji Yong and Hitanari Suji, set to premiere on September 27th. This poignant tale follows Choi Hong, played by Lee Se Young, a Korean student studying in Japan, and Aoki Jungo, a Japanese man. Their love story is marked by differences in their views on love and the practical challenges they face, leading to a breakup. However, five years later, they reunite in Korea, where unresolved feelings resurface, challenging them to confront their past and possibly rekindle their romance. What comes after love promises a deep exploration of love, loss, and second chances. Next, we have Iron Family an intriguing new drama set to premiere on KBS2 on September 28th. Iron Family centers on the Darren family, who run a humble laundry shop with an unusual twist. They iron out more than just clothes. Kim Yoong Hyun stars as Seo Kong Ju, a wealthy executive who reconnects with Lee Darim, portrayed by GM Sayerok, the visually impaired but confident youngest daughter of the laundry shop. Choi Tae Joon plays Cha Tae Woong, a part-time worker who becomes like family to the Darims, while Yang Haiji takes on the role of Lee Charim, the beautiful and open-minded second daughter who struggles with feeling overlooked. Following that, we have Soul Busters, an exciting crime comedy drama set to premiere on Disney Plus in September 11th. This series follows the underdog story of violent crime team 2 at Songwon Police Station. Known as the lowest-ranked team in the country, they are led by the sharp and unpredictable Dong Bang Yubin, played by Lee Dong Wook. 
as the team of misfit detectives embarks on a mission to transform their struggling unit into the nation's top squad, viewers can expect a thrilling mix of crime-solving and comedic moments. With a dynamic cast and a story full of unexpected twists, Soul Busters is set to be a must-watch for fans of crime dramas and comedies alike. Finally, we have Dog Knows Everything, a heartwarming sitcom set to premiere on KBS2 in September. This series follows a lively group of close friends in their 70s, who are still full of zest for life, pursuing their dreams and love lives with boundless enthusiasm. Lee Sun Jae, once a big star, now leads a simpler life, dealing with neighborhood issues with his characteristic humor and wisdom. His friend Kim Young Gun, a former star turned director, adds to the fun with his playful banter, while Lim Chai Moo, after a career in lighting, dreams of becoming a YouTube sensation. Together, this trio proves that age is just a number when it comes to friendship, adventure, and chasing after dreams. Dog knows everything is sure to bring smiles and laughs, showing that life's adventures never truly end. And that concludes the dramas. But one more Korean release is coming this September on Netflix. A film starring Kim Woo-bin. Officer Black Belt is an upcoming South Korean action comedy film premiering on September 13th. Directed and written by Jason Kim, the film offers an exciting mix of martial arts and crime fighting. The story centers on Lee Young-do, portrayed by Kim Woo-bin, a dedicated contractor at the Ministry of Justice. His job involves managing individuals with electronic ankle bracelets, assisting probation officers, and handling emergencies involving verbal abuse or violence. A martial arts expert with third-degree black belts in Judo, Taekwondo, and Kendo, Lee young Du uses his skills to monitor offenders and prevent crimes, making him a formidable force in maintaining order. We hope you enjoyed this overview of the K-dramas coming in September. Thank you for watching. See you next time.